So I just finished doing one of Beto's hangout events. That was actually pretty cool. If you guys want to check that out, just uh, it'll be in the description. Uh, otherwise, we're going to be doing this one next. Guros, the canine's general special operations. Kind of curious, actually. So he's like a puppers, right? This makes me wonder if we're going to see more of the um, more doggos. That'd be pretty cool. Since we're going to be doing this one, I kind of feel like I want Single Nomiya on the team. I want Kokomi on the team. It's only fitting, right? I don't have Goro. I don't think anyone has him. Because <laughs> he's not even out yet. <laughs> Oh, <gasps> it's Yaimiko. I really can't recommend that store highly enough. A couple more visits and you'll find that the fur on your tail is silky smooth. Hi. Let me just uh, take this photo, save it because it's probably going to use for a thumbnail. Thank you very much. A gorgeous tail like yours deserves lots of tender loving care. TLC. <laughs> Don't you agree? Uh, no need. I'm not uh, interested in that kind of thing. Stay away from her. She's mine. That. But do I see your ears saying otherwise? Although your tail isn't professionally maintained, the fur doesn't look dry and coarse. To me, this says you like to take care of it. I'm also guessing that you like to curl up into a fetal position and hug your fluffy tail tight as you go <laughs> off to sleep. How do you know? <clears throat> Don't. Be ridiculous. I'm a high-ranking general of Watatsumi Island. How could I do such a thing? <laughs> oh, it's okay. There's no need to be embarrassed. The desire to cuddle up to a soft tail while sleeping is quite natural. Really? Gosh, she has such a soothing Wait, voice. No. Why are we still on this topic? In fact, why am I even here talking about tails with you in the first place? Why? Because you are blessed with a wonderful fluffy tail, that's why. I think it's very cute. Oh my goodness. Oh, I'm trapped. How do I get out of this? Alright, that's enough. Enough shrimping. Stay away from each other. It's you! Oh my goodness. Please save me. Oh, and how is my favorite little one doing, hmm? Oh, I'm the I favorite. Let's go. You here. We were just talking about tails. Goro has a beautiful tail, don't you think? Doesn't it make you want to stroke it? I'm just gonna look at Yaimiko. <laughs> I actually really want that one as a, a photo as well, because she has like that smug smirk. That's definitely a uh, thumbnail material. Okay. <laughs> Don't be nervous. Just follow your heart's desire. Oh, yes. oh, you don't want that. Fall for it. We've fought side by side. Uh, pardon me. Lady Gucci, we have completed the matter you instructed us about previously. We have selected a very skilled artist to be in charge. I'm confident that the finished product will be to your satisfaction. Oh? I'll take a look later, and if everything's in order, place it in front of the store. All right. I won't tease the two of you any further. Do make the most of your trip here, won't you? Quite a lot has changed. <laughs> I wish you both a fun-filled time on Narukami Island. I thought we were gonna hang out with Yaimiko as well for some reason. Just there seeing her from there. Something strange about the way she looked at me in the end there. Could she be plotting something? Oh, she wants that puppy. You want? I'm not gonna say anything more. <laughs> Sorry that you had to see that. The real reason I'm here at Yai Publishing House is to buy some books for Her Excellency. Since Watatsumi Island signed a peace treaty with the Shogunate, we've had much closer contact than we did before. I also wanted to come and see what things are like in an area ruled by the Shogunate. I hadn't counted on running into her. So do you know her well? Uh, I've interacted with her a few times before, but I can't say I've ever gotten used to it. I've never been good at dealing with people like her. The way she towers over me and speaks so cryptically. Something about her is strangely intimidating. 
I could probably deal with her in battle, but I don't know where to start when I run into her in normal life. I guess this is a weakness of mine. Oh, trust me, you can't even handle her in battle. She's much more powerful. But how about I help you overcome this weakness? Really? That would be great. To be honest, this is something that's always worried me. If the soldiers ever saw me in this kind of embarrassing situation, they'd be very disappointed. So, I have to overcome it for their sake. Oh, uh, such a as good soon guy. As I work through this. Let's go take on Yaimiko again. <sighs> First things first. Oh, though. we're gonna go see Do you her have again. Any ideas on where to begin? Hmm. <laughs> Let's see. We can start with some. No, let's do the second one. I can act as a personality you find difficult to deal with. Since I have so many different personalities, this might be the best option. I see. So if you pretend to be someone like her, I can keep practicing on you. If I can get the better of you, then I'll be able to hold my own when similar situations come up in the future. Yeah. Good plan. Let's see. Where should we start? Well, have you found yourself in scenarios like this before? Hmm. Now that you mention it, I remember having a similar experience back on Watatsumi Island. I was with my subordinates at the time. We ran into a merchant, I got caught up talking to them, and I don't quite know what happened, but I ended up buying a lot of things from them. I see. Then I guess I'll pretend to be a merchant, because I could go for some more. I think we can give it a try. There's an island called Rito nearby. Why don't we go there? I heard oh, all the Rito. Outlander merchants are based there, so it might help to create the right atmosphere. I hate that place. Why we gotta go to such a... Ugh. When I first got here, I was like, this place sucks. But I guess that's why it's good, because that's that's how you're supposed to feel when you come here. So this is Rito. Yeah, it is. Although it looks slightly gloomy, it feels very peaceful here. I don't see any Tenryo Commission soldiers roaming the streets. What this is actually place? a good thumbnail as well. The thinking pose. 10 out of 10. Let me just uh, save that. Okay, we're good. Okay. Let's get started. I'll be me, and you'll be a shrewd and savvy businesswoman. A businesswoman, huh? Okay. <clears throat> Welcome to Sukumo -ma 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 -no -no -mo. Groceries. We got everything you need. Hi. <clears throat> Hi. So, a, a lot of the soldiers have been complaining about a shortage of blankets recently. So, uh, ten blankets, please? Twenty thousand more. Okay. I'll settle the check right away. That's it? Just like that? The price seems pretty cheap to me. In which case, no need to haggle, right? 200,000 more, then. I think that's still not too bad. Is that supposed to be really expensive? This guy. Uh, I'm sorry. In the past, Her Excellency has always handled procurement of military supplies. I don't know the specific prices of these items, so I never really know how to respond. <sighs> this won't get us anywhere. I have to haggle to give you the chance to use your wily tricks on me. What um, do we do now? Well, then let's switch to something you're more interested in. Something I'm more interested in? Hmm. Maybe, um, cake? 100,000 more for a slice of cake. That's so expensive. I know what a fair price is when it comes to cake. <laughs> well, if you can do one little thing for me. Wait a sec, if you think about this from another angle, a cake that costs 100,000 more per slice must be so much better this than a regular guy. cake. Oh, let me see, I've been saving up recently. I think I should have enough. Hold on. So, there isn't really a kind of cake that costs 100,000 more per slice? I don't know. <sighs> what a shame. I feel like role-playing as a vendor is a little outside our area of expertise. What kind of person do we both see regularly enough to impersonate convincingly? Hmm, well, I think I met Fatui with the right kind of personality. Fatui? Then it looks like a trip into the wild is in order. Let's go give it a try! I could pretend I was reunited with my sister. It'll be the perfect opportunity to practice. But when the time eventually comes when I betray everyone and become a Fatui member, of my own v will. 
My own fellow nation. That's not even a word. I don't even know what word I was trying to get. So, wilds of Narakami Island, where the Faturi are. There's no Faturi here. Jump. I've dealt with Fatui before, but I always end up against those big, stocky guys who are much taller than me. I'm sure. I oh, the ones with the sniper. They do every day, but somehow, I still don't have the muscles to show for it. Maybe I'll start to see the results in a few more years. Well, I like you just the way you are. You're a fine little pupper uh, person. You're a fine person, just the way you are. Really? That's very kind. But still, I think that I should aim to look more muscular than my subordinates at the very least. I know that people's trust in me has nothing to do with my size, but if I were taller and bulkier, they'd be able to identify me from behind more easily when charging into battle. That way, our forces wouldn't scatter so easily. As long as I was on the field, they'd be able to follow me. But enough of that. Let's get back to it. Who are you going to roleplay as this time? Hmm... <laughs> Oh, jeez. These are all good ones. I actually don't recognize the more the merrier line, though. But I do recognize let me amuse myself a little very often. Or are you here to play with me? I kind of want to do the, the one on the left, though. Let me amuse myself a little. Heck yeah. What? I smell danger! <laughs> <laughs> Looks like I was pretty convincing. This is a G. He's so adorable like that. Let me just uh, take this one too. I don't know which one I'm going to use. Watch me end up just using the ending screen. <laughs> really? Huh. For a moment there, I could have sworn the actual Fatui were right here. No, wait. Behind you. It wasn't my imagination. They really are here. Well, Prepare to engage. Well, darn. I thought I was a pretty good actor, but I guess not. It was just someone behind us this whole time. There's someone behind me the whole time! Man. Alright. Wait, did that... I don't know if that one even saved. I might have exited too early. Oh, okay, it did. Oh! There she is! That's the one I impersonated. Illusion shattered! She said the line! She said the thing! Okay, Klee, you got this. Enemy where? Enemy gone. Dang, the damage is way too high. Wait, where'd you go? I'm not used to having five on the keyboard or five in these fights. So I always hit like the wrong button. More of you. There is no escape. Now you shall perish. Why is there so many? Everyone on me! Well, luckily I'm so powerful. We did it. It's all fun and games until the real Fatui show up, huh? You just see fire and ice everywhere. <laughs> that little interruption has really ruined the mood for me. Let's not do any more Fatui impressions for today. It seems in poor taste <laughs> after the trouble they caused in Watatsumi Island, anyway. Do we have any other options? Time for Plan Z. I mean Z. Huh. What do you mean? Let's cut to the chase. I will imitate the person you fear the most. Uh, is this moving a little too fast? Her Excellency advocates slow and steady progress in all things and cautions against trying to advance too quickly. I call BS. To clarify, it's not that I'm scared. It's just that I don't know if the time is right. Well, it's time to take this step. So, you're going to do it regardless. Because I said so.
Yeah, every time you guys hear that sound, that's me saving a photo. Uh, I guess you're right. Thanks for your encouragement. It's Aww. not like me to shy away from a challenge like this. Let's do it. Time for a make or break training exercise. So hit the Inazuma City streets. All right. <laughs> I wonder what Yaimiko would think about this situation if I told her. And we're back. Ready? Don't worry. My head's in the game this time. I am a high-ranking military officer of Watatsumi Island and the General of the Resistance. Whatever tricks you've got up your sleeve, you're not going to get to me. I wouldn't so be so sure. How adorable. Hmm. This feels like... Go on, let me rub your ears. Yes, it definitely feels like... Yai, Miko? Uh, no, not even slightly. Wait, what? It's not that you do a bad impression of her. More like... Something is missing. I finally realized it when you were talking to me just now. I think that maybe what I'm really afraid of is her knowing smile and her piercing gaze. It just makes me feel like all my secrets have nowhere to hide, like she can just peer in and see them. But it's different with you. I trust you, so I don't feel I need to hide my secrets in the first place. Aww. Even when you're imitating the way she speaks, I don't feel afraid. Because we fought side by side in the past, and I know I don't have to have my guard up around you. Oh, I want to give him a hug and pat his head, rub the ears. Mess with the uh, hair. I almost said fur. <laughs> <sighs> but it also means that this training won't work. I just have to accept that this is a weakness of mine, as much as it pains me to do so. The thought of having to live with this weakness forever is frustrating. Huh. Well, why don't we go buy some cake? Are you serious? I'd love that. I haven't eaten anything sweet in a long time. Off we go. Let's go buy some cake. Yeah. Cake break. All right. The next step is to find somewhere nice and quiet. Nice and quiet? How about the shrine? You know, the one with Yaimiko. <laughs> mm, mm, this is so good. So, you don't get to eat cake very often. <laughs> it's certainly a rarity in the camp. It's seen as a luxury item in the ranks of the Resistance. We have special meals on occasion, but even then it usually means meat and wine, not dessert. So, thank you for treating me to some cake. The only downside with Narukami Island's pastries is that they're such exquisite things, you can't just chow down on them. But, as Her Excellency says, a general needs to show patience and restraint. Uh, well, since you already finished yours, you, you want to try some of mine? Wow, uh... Don't mind if I do. Hmm. That's so sweet. <laughs> oh, look at him. Oh, I offered the cake to him and he's so happy. Oh, that was, that's very wholesome. I like that. He, he feels like, he feels like a pet doggo, doesn't he? He feels like a pet puppers. Oh my goodness. He, he's totally a pet peppers. Oh, I love him so much. <laughs> oh, goodness. If you guys would like to see me do more of these, just uh, let me know. Maybe in the comments. Maybe by liking the video. Maybe by even subbing. It shows in the analytics. But thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time for more Genshin Impact. Peace.